journey back to an era dominated by the astonishing Titanoboa. This colossal snake thrived 60 to 58 million years ago during the Paleocene epoch. Its remains were unearthed in Colombia, offering a glimpse into Earth's earliest rainforests. The discovery began in the early 2000s, yielding 186 fossils from 30 individual Titanoboas. Initially misidentified, closer examination revealed them to be from a giant Boyd snake. In 2009, it was named Titanoboa serigenensis for its massive size and classification. Titanoboa was the largest snake ever discovered, reaching lengths of 42 to 50 feet. It weighed between 1,610 to 2,500 pounds, with a body approximately three feet wide. Its robust pentagonal vertebrae were similar to other members of the Boine subfamily. Titanoboa thrived in the hot, humid environment of Paleocene South America, a swampy landscape. Scientists estimate its habitat's mean temperature was between 86 to 93 degrees Fahrenheit. This warm climate was crucial for its large size as reptiles rely on external temperatures. As a semi-aquatic apex predator, Titanoboa's diet primarily consisted of fish. It likely hunted on land and in water, ambushing prey, and may have consumed crocodilians and turtles. As a constrictor, it would squeeze prey until suffocation, then swallow them whole. Titanoboa is classified within the family Boidae, which includes modern boas and anacondas. It stands as the only known extinct genus in this subfamily, a unique evolutionary link. Its discovery provided insights into the Paleocene epoch's climate, suggesting warmer tropics. Fossils found alongside Titanoboas support this hot, humid, and biodiverse environment. Titanoboas' existence challenges assumptions about tropical climates and climate change's impact on reptiles. This find offers a glimpse into a lost world, helping us understand ecosystem evolution after dinosaur extinction. The Titanoboa remains a powerful reminder of Earth's ancient past and its incredible diversity of life.